Hello everyone, this is Puka, and welcome to the ninth episode of Deck Wizard Wednesday. We took a little bit of a break since we had a lot of stuff to cover with Pokemon X and Y out. And I decided now is a good time to get back to the Deck Wizard. So, I think what I'm going to start doing is just go in randomly. It seems like the most fun uh, and uh, has the most potential. And we, we aren't limited to, to what I wanted to have the deck wizard do. We just let him go on his merry way and pick us 60 cards so we don't give him any guidance. Let's go. Let's pick random and wait while the deck wizard conjures my deck. And we'll see what he thinks is the best 60 cards he can come up with out of my collection. Of course, this will probably be terrible, but I'm interested to see what's going to happen. And hopefully this will be... More entertaining than just picking a couple of cards and seeing what other junk he throws in. Alrighty, so let's take a look. We got four Emolga. I didn't even know I had four of these full art Emolga, but apparently I do. Alright, so we got Call for Family and Static Shock. Not great, not terrible. Uh, it's a starter Pokemon at least. I'll, I'll take it. Two Zekrom EX, alright. We got a big basic Pokemon to work with. I can live with that. Uh, three Chandelure EX. More big basic EXs to work with. Alright, I, I can deal with this. Maybe we can work with it. Three Mewtwo EX. There's a big one. Uh, we got a real attacker. I'm sure we didn't get double colorless energy, but that's whatever. Uh, oh, and a fourth Mewtwo EX. The promo one as well. Guess he decided to split up 3-1 here, but we do have four Mewtwo. So we got that going for us. And, uh... Three Woobat, three Swoobat. Oh, well, actually, Energy Gift might not be bad with the old uh, the old Mewtwo here. So we got some Synergy here, Energy Gift. Flip a coin if head, search your deck for two Psychic Energy, and attach them to your Pokemon in any way you like. All right. So we just got to flip heads on Energy Gift and power up our Psychic Pokemon. And uh, apparently one Jet Woofer Swoobat for good measure. So those are the Pokemon of the deck. Let's see what we got for the trainers. Four energy switch, so we can really keep our opponent off guard with the energy switching. Uh, one heavy ball, so we can search for Zekrom EX. Uh, four <laughs> Pokemon catcher, all right. Deck wizard came to gamble. Okay, four Iris. We're gonna be doing some additional damage. <laughs> All right, Iris. Two Professor Juniper. All right, got some solid draw cards here. Uh, two Tropical Beach. Got some real solid draw cards here. Yeah, only four total draw cards, but whatever. Uh, and then three Hard Charm to keep our Pokemon alive. So I got to say, a if we're going to build a deck that has 20 Pokemon, 20 Trainer, 20 Energy, this is probably one of the best combinations you can have. Big basic Pokemon, ways to keep them alive. Uh, Pokemon, Catcher, <laughs> I guess, uh, and 4 Iris to try to do additional damage. For the energy, we have 14 Psychic, 6 Lightning, so I'm, uh, I'm optimistic. Let's, let's see what we got here. Deck, Wizard Wednesday, number 9. Let's go ahead and save this and head right into a game. Uh, we'll head over to the multiplayer, random battle, ranked... And there we go. Deck Wizard Wednesday number nine. There we go. Guest against Sacklass 29. Okay. So you never know what's going to happen in a Deck Wizard Wednesday game. Never know what you're going to go up against. Um, looks like we're probably going to go second. That's okay. But yeah, uh, you never really know what to expect. You don't know if we're going to face you know, a really good deck. A really bad deck, or, or what's what's going to happen here? I'm going to open up with the Chandelure EX, since we can put on some pressure right away with a Cursed Drop. It looks like we will be going second. I wish I would have known that for sure, but uh, I'm definitely going to put Chandelure out there, since you can attack for one Psychic Energy. There's a Hypnotoxic Laser. Boo. Boo Laser. Man, a Juniper. So, looks like this might be some kind of a Dark Ride deck. You see the Darkness Energy featuring Ninetales as well. Uh, we were seeing Eevee as well, though. So, I don't know. Not too sure what to make of this. 
But the uh, poison here is definitely gonna gonna hurt. Uh, and I, oh, I don't even wake up. All right, that is a major bummer. All right, so we're gonna put the hard charm on the Chandelure EX. We're just gonna attach to the Mewtwo now and pass. All right, so that was a big, big disappointment. <laughs> Didn't even get to curse drop turn one, but uh, you know, we'll put the hard charm on the Chandelure to maybe block damage from Nine Tails' hex flame if that happens let's see a darkness energy i'm really not sure what this deck is maybe uh oh we got a singe okay so huh all right well i'm confused but what the hey let's just go with it uh let's uh, we drop down the woobat and let's go with a curse drop i'm gonna drop two on the vulpix and i guess two on the eevee as well this is gonna allow us to um, pick off one of the Pokemon if we can, and then if this evolves into Nine Tails and knocks me out, I can respond with an Iris and an X Ball if I draw an energy and take the knockout there. So that's the thought process. And we do have the Eevee coming out. Uh, I don't know what this is gonna evolve into. Could be like a Leafeon. Um, Umbreon I don't think really does much. Depending on which Umbreon it is. And it only has a darkness energy. But oh, he's going to signs of evolution. Okay. That's okay with me. Now the Chandelure is slowly getting knocked out. Uh, I'm actually going to target down the Eevee. Since my opponent just took evolutions for it. And I guess that seems like the right thing to do. Uh, do I bother with the Pokemon Catcher? I don't really know. Uh, I could catch out Vulpix. Make it more difficult for my opponent to really do anything. So I think I might do that. Um, we'll go for it. Got a Tails. All right, so we're going to Curse Drop. Just drop four on the Eevee so that it doesn't evolve. My opponent was not knocked out by damage, so he doesn't get the Rescue Scarf activation. And Chandelure EX is going to take a prize. Okay. And we're slowly dying of poison and burn, but it's okay. <laughs> We will survive for a little bit longer, I think. And now the Sableye comes active, and we'll have to see what happens from here. Now I got another energy finally. We see a double colorless on the Sableye. Confuse Ray and a Tails, thankfully. Uh, I didn't want to be inflicted by a bazillion status conditions. Um, but all right, let's go ahead and drop this lightning onto the Mewtwo. And now we can curse drop. Knock out the Vulpix, and we are one step closer to winning. Oh, baby. And we got another Mewtwo out of the prizes. There's a Professor's Letter, and you know, maybe we could win next turn. We got the Energy Switch ready to go if we get Energy Switch and uh, Eerie Glow. We could win the game depending on what happens here. Will my opponent go for the Junk Hunt or the Confuse Ray? Now, Confuse Ray would make this uh, a little bit trickier, I guess, on what my decision would be. But if he goes for the Junk Hunt, we just win with an Energy Switch and an Eerie Glow. Uh, we see the laser, and that's going to be it. Chandelure. We're going to go ahead and Energy Switch to the Active Attach. And Eerie Glow for the game. And I don't believe it. Deck Wizard Wednesday gets a victory with the random selection. So I think we're going to keep doing this random selection and see if we get different results each time. I would assume we will, since it's supposed to be random. Um, but, well, Chandelure Mewtwo takes the win. I have no idea what my opponent's deck actually was there, but Chandelure EX takes the cake there. MVP takes down three straight Pokemon, and that is going to be the game. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll definitely have another adventure on next week's Deck Wizard Wednesday. But until next time, thanks for watching, guys. This is Puka from the Top Cut. I'll have some more videos for you guys soon, and I'll see you guys next time.